guys, happy Tuesday. I feel like I should start this off with an apology because I know my videos are supposed to go up on Tuesday, but it's currently Tuesday and I'm filming this week's video, which is exactly what happened, I think, last week and possibly even the week before. Things have just been extremely overwhelming lately and I don't want to make excuses and I know I'm supposed to have a video up on Tuesday, trust me, like, I beat myself up about it all the time. There are just a lot of things going on right now and I am having a hard time just scheduling everything, getting everything done on time when there's not a lot of structure to my life. And the biggest thing that I'm dealing with right now is that I'm living at home. My schedule largely depends on like other people's schedule, like if my parents are here or if someone's coming to work on something in the house during the day or if I need to babysit somebody's kid or like take my grandma to the grocery store. Like because I don't have a job, people expect me to or want me to help with other things and I don't really have an excuse to be like, oh no, I'm working on filming a video today. Like writing blog posts, filming videos, applying to jobs, that's not my job. That's just what I do because I have so much free time. So I don't really have an excuse not to help people or not to be here when stuff's going on or not to clean the kitchen when my mom asked me to clean the kitchen, <laughs> things like that. I realize that my videos have been late. That's partially due to the fact that I don't have a schedule. Also due to the fact that my internet at home has been awful. Like I don't have another word to explain it. We only have a limited amount of Wi-Fi per month. And when we use that Wi-Fi every month, it slows down significantly. I've basically just come to the realization this month that I can't upload videos when I'm here. So I'm going to have to figure out something else to do and I just haven't figured that out yet. So I apologize if blog posts and videos and stuff are just sporadic. It's just gonna be very difficult and I just wanna apologize like both for what's been going on the last few weeks and what will likely be going on the next few weeks. I would love to be doing videos and blog posts and stuff full Mandy? Mandy? Where are you? Come here! What's wrong, kitty? Oh, you don't like me? Okay, that was weird. So currently I'm trying to figure out what videos I want to film and what blog posts I want to write. Let me just show you what this looks like. I have an insane Google Doc full of blog post ideas. This is what my schedule looks like. These are all stuff that I've done, all the blog posts I've written, all the videos I've filmed. So yeah, I'm like sifting through vlog ideas. I'm sifting through blog post ideas and just trying to get a sense of what I want to be putting into the internet universe. So one thing I definitely want to do on my blog is like my list of top 10 podcasts, movies, TV shows, books, things like that I would love to do. I also want to do like music playlists. Um, I'm not sure if anyone else did this in high school, but I would pass around notebooks with my friends and we would make each other like small music playlists. Sometimes it was just new songs that we were listening to. Other times they were like tailored to the things we were all going through, whether it was breakups, relationships, just anxiety, test stress, like things like that. And I would love to make just short little playlists for those type of things. I just think that would be super fun. I definitely wanna to try to start doing that. So yeah, that's what I'm currently working on. If you were curious, make sure to keep an eye out on my blog. Hopefully I can get things out more frequently on there since I'm not doing a very good job. I was just sitting here eating my lunch, watching Alfie Day's latest vlog. And I just remembered Pretty Little Liars is on tonight. It is the second to last episode in the final season. This has been seven seasons and it's almost over. That's kind of insane. There are very few shows that I've watched like since the beginning and have watched continuously through this many seasons. So this is like kind of a big deal. Like I can remember watching this show for the first time and now here we are like seven seasons later and there are only two episodes left and one of them is tonight. If you've been watching this show forever, I wanna know if you've been watching. I also wanna know who your favorite liar is. Cause I feel like this is a serious conversation. Personally, Spencer is my favorite. She's always been my favorite. I love Troyan. She's tweeted at me once, not a big deal. <laughs> so yeah, I'm so excited. I can't believe that's today. Like, I, uh, I don't know how to feel. <laughs>
I totally cannot see myself in the viewfinder, so hopefully this is recording and hopefully you can see me. I'm also dangerously dangling this camera over a pool, so fingers crossed, nothing bad happens. <laughs> so I just finished writing a blog post. Yes, now I am chilling at the pool. The sun just came out. I just felt like sticking my feet in the pool for a minute just to relax. So a couple videos ago, I mentioned doing like fun, different segments in videos. And one of the things I mentioned was doing like pop culture discussions, like just talking about new fun things that are happening in pop culture at the moment that I'm going to call pop culture chats today for lack of a better name. First thing on the list has to be the Bachelorette was on last night. I don't know if you guys watched this, but last night, Rachel on their group date made all the guys do a spelling bee championship thing. And can I just say, like, if I was gonna be the Bachelorette, 100% would make every guy go through like a spelling grammar test. That's the funniest, best thing I've ever seen in my entire life. Like if a guy can't spell the word stunning, we're probably not gonna work. Like, let's be honest. If you don't know the difference between there, there, and there, why why continue the relationship? <laughs> that's just me. That may not be you, but that's 100% me. And I feel like if I were dating a bunch of guys and I was trying to weed them out, that would be like the perfect way to do it. <laughs> While we're talking about the bachelor, bachelorette thing, um, I feel like we should also mention the whole bachelor in paradise stuff that's going on right now. I can't say I have that many thoughts on it, um, it's kind of one of those things where the truth will come out eventually, like there's no sense in me forming an opinion based on hearsay at this point, if you know what I mean. If you have no idea what I'm talking about, don't bother. Like, at this point, I really don't feel like it's something to talk about. Obviously, like with something like this, it's all on camera and there's no sense if, in my opinion, just to listen to what everybody's saying and try to come up with some conclusion because there won't be one anytime soon. So earlier, I said something along the lines of all they have to do is look at the video from Bachelor in Paradise and then we'll have our answer and that's it. And sure enough, today we have our answer. <laughs> Sometimes things just coincidentally just fall right into place at the right time. But yeah, you probably know this already by the time this video goes up, but apparently there was no evidence of any sort of misconduct or whatever the heck they called it. The shocking part about all of this is apparently they're going to resume filming, which I just don't know how you come back from something like that. I, I don't know. I would have just canceled it, but obviously it's not my show. But back to Rachel and The Bachelorette. Who do you think she's gonna pick? Do you have any thoughts? Do you have any guesses? I know a lot of people like read spoilers. Personally, I've been watching this show for so long, I feel like I can tell who she's gonna pick based on how they edit all the people. So I feel like it's gonna be either Peter or Dean. I'm hoping for Peter. I think he seems quite nice. I think his name is Peter. So yeah, that's where I'm at with that. And I'm really hot, so I'm gonna go inside. I have gotten so much done today. It's been a few hours and I have not moved. <laughs> I planned out my day, I scheduled everything, and I'm actually ahead of schedule. I've written a blog post, I've applied to a job, I've responded to a handful of emails, and I'm feeling pretty good about myself, to be honest. <laughs> I have to be my own cheerleader right now and keep pushing myself forward in the hopes of eating pizza and ice cream while watching Pretty Little Liars. <sighs> very soon, very soon, I can do this. I can genuinely say, not much feels better than getting stuff done during the day. Like I had so much on my to-do list and I got done more than I planned to get done. And I feel <laughs> so good. Like compared to how I felt this morning, I feel at least 10 times better. So I'm gonna chill out, watch some YouTube videos and eat a snack of Jell-O and Cheetos. Yes, that's weird, but I totally deserve it. Is this sunbathing me, Andy? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Literally two hours, guys until Pretty Little Liars. I'm eating hummus in anticipation. <laughs> Pros of being home alone. You get to eat whatever the heck you want for dinner, even if it's unhealthy and awful for you. Cons of living alone. You have to decide for yourself if you want pizza or chicken strips and mashed potatoes for dinner. How is someone supposed to make that decision on their own? <sighs> Stay tuned to see what I picked. <laughs>
It's time! I don't even want to know what I'm going to be like next week when it's the last episode. <laughs> I'm going to go insane. Well, uh, <laughs> I don't know. I'd give it like a B plus. Mostly because like half of it I called, the other half just like got no resolve whatsoever. Anyway, I'm not gonna spoil it. Excited for next week. Those are my final thoughts. <laughs>guys um i hope you enjoyed spending the day with me been on kind of a roller coaster of emotions today <laughs> um but thanks so much for making me productive i feel so much better so make sure to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already if you enjoyed this random vlog thing this is me this is my channel thanks so much for watching and i will see you next week hopefully bye